Hi, this is James from tracermap.co.uk and from boxes.com and I just want to give you a further demonstration video of the uh, the Blackberry Bold, the 9780. Um, hopefully you saw the unboxing video that I did. Uh, I kept that kept that brief and said that I'd bring you a further demo. So uh, so here I am, a man of my word, and I just want to sh show you the uh, some of the main features on uh, uh, on 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 Blackberry 6, uh, really because although we have seen Blackberry 6 before on the torch, this is the first uh, non touchscreen BlackBerry to launch with uh, BlackBerry 6 here in the UK. So first off, let's uh, have a look at uh, how we set up connections, and that's done right at the very top. So if we scroll to the top and press the trackpad, that will, will allow you to turn your mobile network on or off, manage Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, um, set up connections, that sort of thing. Fairly straightforward, nice and easy. Next, we have notifications, which. Uh, I haven't actually got any new ones at the moment. If I did, uh, just under the clock, I would uh, get some uh, little icons appear. Um, if they do, you can press that, and that will uh, will show you any emails you have, uh, any calendar appointments, missed phone calls, that sort of thing. And then we've got universal search, and there's two ways of doing this. Uh, the first one is uh, on the right hand side, just there. There's a little search button. You can uh, you can either click on that, which I really don't see the point of doing that on a non-touch device. It's handy to have it there on the torch, but the easiest way to do it is just to start typing. If we type in Tracy and Matt, and then what the, uh, the um, what the BlackBerry will do is filter down all the applications uh, on the device that will possibly relate to whatever it is you're searching for. Um, again, it's a real easy way of, uh, of finding something, whether it be a message, uh, an application, um, a, a document or file. It's uh, just nice, easy peasy. So then we have a quick look at the menu. Now, um, again, like on the torch, we can open it up and it reveals the full menu. But we can also scroll left and right. So we've got a favourites one, a media one, a downloads, frequent, and back to uh, back to all. And let's go back to the uh, media album. Sorry, the media folder and we'll have a look there. Uh, pictures first of all. So looking at pictures again this is not too dissimilar to what we've seen uh, on OS 5 but it's just a case of clicking on them and uh, and scrolling through the ones you want and uh, here's some uh, pictures of funny people with wigs on. What you can do from here is um, you've got the option to uh, to send the picture, and you can either do that by email, text message, uh, BlackBerry Messenger, um, or if you've got any other applications, I've got uh, the application WhatsApp on here, so uh, you can send that as well. And there's obviously Bluetooth there, so sending files is nice and easy. Uh, quick look at the music player. Um, and if we go to artists, select one. We can either shuffle songs or we can just play the, the whole lot basically. Just turn that down a bit. So as you can see, um, at the bottom of the screen you've got controls if you want to skip a track or pause. Uh, above that you've got the, uh, the sort of, what I suppose I call it, a time bar. Uh, and if you click on that and sort of hold down the uh, the optical trackpad you can actually sort of slide back and forth throughout the throughout the song like so very straightforward and that's someone sending me a message on Blackberry Messenger um, videos that, they seem to work very nice as well let's uh, just show you a very quick one Again, due to the screen size, I don't know if you're going to be wanting to watch a, a whole movie on the uh, on the, on the Blackberry Gold 9780, but uh, the option is there if you want to. Looks alright, doesn't it? Okay, let's have a quick look at the, uh, the the camera interface. So this again is the same as we've seen uh, on the uh, on the on the Blackberry Gold uh, 9700. It's a case of just. Uh, it auto focuses like so. There we go. 
sorted. So there's a few on-screen options at the bottom here. Um, there's various scenes. I'll obviously list all these in the uh, the full review. Uh, you can change the flash settings, and then there's a um, this down here. You see a, a preview of the one you've just taken. You can jump into that uh, or scroll through, like so. And there's Holly. She's my hamster. The video, uh, the video, uh, the camcorder interface is. Uh, is identical. Uh, the last thing I'll show you quickly is the browser which uh, is certainly improved and what I will do is let's do a little test alongside the uh, the, the, the 9700 which uh, on, on OS 5. Um, let's decide what website we're going to go to. Um, in fact I think we'll do a, we'll do a, we'll do a new one. Um, let's just BBC News like so and then we'll, uh, we'll press go at the same time and this will uh, obviously give us the Google search first and as you can see the, uh, the 9780's uh, <laughs> done it already whereas the 9700 is still thinking about it both devices are connected over my Wi-Fi so uh, they're running at uh, identical speeds there we go and then we'll uh, we'll click on both of them and, uh, and we'll get the, uh, the the BBC News page running. There we go. Oh, I don't think it actually worked <laughs> on the United Seven Hundred. Oh well. Anyway, you can see that the. Uh, the new WebKit browser on uh, on, on BlackBerry 6 is, uh, is, is definitely faster, there's no doubt about it, a fast improvement. Um, you know, it's it's not perfect, you know, browsing on this is certainly different to browsing on an iPhone or, a, uh, or an Android device, but uh, you know, it seems to work okay, it uh, loads quickly, scrolling around is, is fairly fluent. You can add bookmarks and well, then you've got your bookmarks listed there so uh, overall a, a vast improvement so I hope that helps a little bit if you're thinking about getting the uh, the bold 9780 uh, um, the review will be online in the next week or two so uh, in the meantime thanks for watching Bitdefender is dedicated to protecting people's digital lives, so working with Unboxings.com to help preview and review the latest technology is a perfect fit.